Okay, here we go. Usually, Bluetooth uh, computers don't come with Bluetooth. We want to hook up our uh, our headphones, our Bluetooth headphones, and uh, so we have to get a Bluetooth adapter. And so let's. Uh, Okay, so we'll open this up and see see how to install this. Okay, so get this thing out of there. Okay, here's our Bluetooth dongle. Plugs into the USB. Okay, so that plugs in the USB. And we've got some directions here, so we'll take a look at this. Okay, so it looks like it comes with a CD also. And the CD's got the drivers for our Bluetooth. And we will put it into our optical drive. Oh, what's this in there? Okay. There we go. Got our disc in there. And close it up. And we will try to install the drivers. Okay, it looks like it has auto run here. Okay, so it looks like I thought it was going to run okay, but it looks like it's not going to. So we'll go down to the folders and here we are. The Bluetooth drive and uh, I guess we'll auto run the application. Okay, so do you want to allow the program to make changes? Okay, so we'll try that. Yes. We'll run setup. Okay. Let's we'll see what happens. Oh, okay, I guess there were some things under here they wanted you to click yes or no, so let's. Click on that guy. Is that how far it's going to look? Ah. Oh, what's that? The camera size is like, looks 20 times further than it actually is. Oh, you mean on the screen? Yeah, well this is the only active area, so... Okay, so here's the Bluetooth installer. So I guess we'll say agree and install. Well, I mean, you are going to blur this stuff out, aren't you? Oh, sure. Because I have all my um, game ideas right there. Oh, yes, I'll blur those. You, you can't read those anyway. I can. Okay, so it wants to uh, have the Bluetooth installed. Although the directions down here didn't tell me to put it in yet, so we'll take this guy, and I guess we will find an open USB port. And it looks like there's some chargers here, some other things. Let's plug that guy in. Get into the second one down there. Okay. So we have our Bluetooth dongle plugged in. Oh, and it looks like the program has automatically detected it and started doing stuff. So we'll let the program uh, run and see what happens. Okay, so we got our headphones. Can you can we see the headphones, Sarah? So the headphones are turned on, right? Okay, so we have our 
headphones turned on and the direction said something about looking for uh, something under control panel for Bluetooth but I did not find anything under here but did find something down here and add a device Click on Bluetooth down here. Add a device. Okay, so we had so it hooked up. You have it hooked up to more than one other device. Right, so it's hooked up to another device, so it wasn't coming up. So we have our headphones here turned on, and it looks like it found them. And so we'll click on that. Next. And it is connecting to the device sure that this device okay okay so it has been successfully added to the computer and we will cancel out of that and now our headphones should be working so it should be all set okay there you go sir it looks like they're blinking a different color now they got red and blue blinking That's so it's not. Okay. It never does that. Okay, well these are new ones. Maybe they work better. Yeah. Okay, this is Dr. Jane's and thanks for watching. They're working okay, Sarah? Mm-hmm. Is there any way